Ladies and gentlemen gather round, because today we're diving deep into one of the most jaw-dropping stories in the history of gold mining Imagine Striking. A gold mine so rich, so monumental, that it not only shakes up your life, but rewrites the rules of an entire industry. That's exactly what happened to Parker Snobble, but his journey wasn't all glittering success. It's a tale of grit, risk, and relentless determination. Buckle up, because this is Parker Schnabel's incredible story, and it's going to blow. Your mind, the story starts in a place most of us would consider unforgiving. The rugged landscapes of Dawson City, Yukon, this is the backdrop of Gold Rush, Discovery Channel's hit show where miners battle the elements and gamble. Everything for that golden gleam from the moment Parker Snobble appeared on our screens as a fresh-faced teenager, it was clear he wasn't your average kid. At just 15 years old, Parker took the reins of his family's big nugget mine after his grandfather, the legendary John. Snobble decided it was time to pass the tour. Now think about this, most teens are worrying about homework or their next video game, but Parker was managing a crew of grizzled miners, many of whom were skeptical of taking orders from a kid, but Parker didn't back down his grandfather's wisdom, combined with his own stubborn drive, helped him tackle one of the toughest industries on the planet. And oh boy, did he deliver by 19 Parker, had outgrown the family operation and decided to take a massive gamble using the funds his grandfather had set aside. For for college, Parker doubled down on his mining dreams. His crew struck 3,300 ounces of gold in his second season. Worth a hopping. $388,000. That moment was a game of changer. It wasn't just gold Parker found in those mines. He discovered his calling from that point forward. Parker was unstoppable. He moved his operation to the expansive, unforgiving Klondike, where extracting even a single ounce of gold can me moving mountains literally parker credits his success to a strategy that's both simple and risky reinvest everything while many in his position might buy flashy cars or sprawling mansions parker's philosophy is different he describes his work as a big costly sandbox where every dime goes back into the business fast forward to today and parker snobble is a household name in the mining world but his latest find it's the stuff of legend this season on gold rush parker and his team faced an uphill battle the the first five weeks were a financial disaster yielding barely any gold the pressure was on and many doubted whether he could turn things around, but Parker being the resilient leader, he is wasn't about to give up. He made a bold $15 million investment into new claims at Dominion Creek, aiming to uncover an estimated $160 million in gold. The results, a mind blowing haul of 7,381 ohms of gold worth approximately $1.5 million. This wasn't just a win. It was a statement. Parker Snobble is not just Mining for gold, he's mining for legacy. But who is Parker Snobble when he's not chasing gold behind the scenes? Parker is refreshingly grounded. He's a man who jokes about being homeless because he doesn't indulge in the luxuries his fortune could afford. Instead, he pours his earnings back into his operations and his crew ensuring everyone who works by his side is well compensated. His journey hasn't been without personal struggles in his E8 season fans watched as Parker navigated a high-profile relationship with Ashley Yu. Despite their chemistry, the pressures of mining and reality TV proved too much, and they eventually parted ways. Parker candidly admitted that his relentless work ethic left little room for a balanced personal life, but his focus remains clear. He's chasing something bigger than himself. Parker's adventures don't end in the Yukon. He's taken his mining expertise to the jungles of Guyana, the mountains of Papua New Guinea, and beyond each location presents unique challenges. But for Parker, it's not just about the gold, it's about growth. His ventures are a testament to his adaptability and his hunger for the next. Big find recently Parker's company. Little Flake Mining partnered with Metallic Minerals to explore a promising stretch of land along Australia Creek in the Yukon. The project aims to uncover millions of ounces of untapped gold and if anyone can pull it off, it's Parker. His plans are ambitious drilling 400 test holes this winter to pave the way for full-scale mining in the spring. Parker Snobble isn't just a miner, he's a trailblazer at 30. He's built a legacy.
that rivals miners twice his age with a net worth of $13 million and a reputation for being one of the most skilled and determined figures in the industry, but for Parker it's not about the money, it's about the thrill of the hunt, the challenge of the unknown, and the satisfaction of turning dirt into destiny as fans we can't wait to see. What's next for Parker Snobble? Will his latest ventures unlock even greater? Rich's only time will tell one things. For sure, Parker isn't slowing down. Anytime soon if you're as inspired by Parker's story as we are, smash that like button and subscribe for more incredible tales of adventure and determination. And let us know in the comments what would you do if you struck gold.